guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is Mozin. please 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 feel welcome to this channel and remember to subscribe like the video share the video as much as you can and feel free to comment down below in the comment section as you can see today i am so colorful i am a christmas tree today What's the reason behind this is that I am in Croatia for my vacation so me and my hubby will be hanging in here for the next 10 days that's a lot I mean it looks a lot but time flies but of course we are going to make sure that we make good use of those 10 days we must have so much fun as much as possible yeah so we are in croatia and today is our day two we arrived yesterday we had a couple of rest of course we walked around just to see the place get familiarized with the place and so today basically we are counting it as day one of having fun so we are heading to the sea and it's amazing let me just show you uh, how it looks like it's very very uh, beautiful the water is clean it's adriatic sea right yeah the water is clean it's a rocky sea by the way you know something funny when i first got myself into a uh, this uh, rocky sea the adriatic sea this is my second time in croatia by the way i was here last year again and that time even croatia was not a european union something amazing is that this year no 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 it was it was it was european union just the currency was not ah the currency was, was not ah it was yeah. already declared the european currency union currency was the kuna uh, kuna yeah we yeah. used and kuna. then they, they changed it to euro ah sorry the guys about that i'm just learning that i'm still learning actually it's a learning process so let's learn together i'm just learning for from my sweetheart here that it was already uh, an EU uh, but I think it's because I saw that you are using lots of the kuna the currency then was kuna so I could be I confused it with it was not yet like uh, European Union yeah so let me just show you a glimpse of how it looks like you know as I take you throughout the process throughout our day at the beach i am used to say at the beach i don't say at the sea i don't know it's because in kenya i'm used to mombasa beach 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 so the sea doesn't like ring a bell that much yeah yeah so i am dressed up and underneath some bikinis cooking i can't wait to unveil the look and you know have fun with you all so we are driving to a much more not of a populated place you know there are a lot of people it's holiday everyone is coming to have fun and so the places are so much sorry sorry about that the places are so much congested so uh hubby did a good job in the morning he went scouting for some nice place where there are not so much people around so you know we can have so much fun and like you know the congestion you know how it goes so yeah so he scouted for some place and we are driving towards there i mean where we where we stay our accommodation is uh, not so far from the sea or the beach allow me to call it the beach because i'm so much used to the beach thing so we are not far it's a walking distance even yesterday we walked ah, yesterday we had so much fun so we it's a, it's a walking distance it's not so far but because we are going to a much more of a less people place so we have to definitely drive because it's quite a distance yes and i learned from my mistake last year i did a very stupid mistake you know um i'm not so much of a sunscreen and all of these things i'm not a fan i feel like i know that is a very dumb thing to do and i know that sounds crazy to you all but i just recently started to take care of my skin i have been having a good skin since a long time ago but i took advantage of that 
so I left it like that. I used to take advantage and I would basically do anything I want with my skin. I wouldn't care. I wouldn't give it so much care and love that it deserves. So sunscreen was not for me. And last year when I came to Croatia, we were in another part. Now we're in a different part in Croatia. Ha! Huh. I got so burnt. I was looking like an old, uh, an old being. Like I was looking so worn out. Like I was so bound, burnt down. Like by the sun, I was burnt. I was so scaly, you know. So I learned from my mistake. And this year I started actually slightly after coming back from our last vacation in Croatia I learned to take care of my skin and that is where uh, mostly my skincare routine journey started so from that time on I've been really really on toss you know and as you can see I am so so backed by sunscreen moisturizer I cleansed my face so I know that I'm not going to get burned this time round. This time round I'm not going back to Germany all extra black. I mean you know you know what the sun does and when you're not when you don't apply sunscreen you know how you get burned. So I'm not doing that kind of business again. I want my skin to be good and this thing I basically taking care of your skin and making sure that you're not getting any uh effects. Yeah, so I want to see how it will turn out, how my skin will turn out by the end of this uh, trip. And I did apply a uh, 50, 50, 50 SPF sunscreen. Can you imagine? Like, this means that I'm not going to get burned anytime at all. At all. So, yeah, let me just show you around the street how it looks like. The weather is great, you all. The weather Hi. is so amazing amazing the sun is shining the weather here is like mombasa i mean it's summer of course it's hot but the heat here you know we're near the sea so the heat here is a bit different there's a bit of a moist i feel like there's a bit of a moist right sweetie just yes. like in mombasa there's this moist when you land in mombasa there's this moist that you feel that is how it is here like it's so hot so hot so hot so let's see let's look at the street yeah so this is how it looks like it's such a beautiful uh, town here such a beautiful beautiful town i'm so much in love with it like i wouldn't know that at some point in time i would find myself in croatia <laughs> in such a place i was just telling my hubby yesterday we had a small talk over dinner and i was like you know i couldn't imagine that one time i would be here you know with such a person you know all happy and well taken care of and you know just being there and being happy and being with the things that matters the being around the people and being around things that matters the most yeah so it's it's been it's been great it's been great i mean i'm just still having challenges adapting and you know uh, fitting in very well in germany of course the language barrier that's that's a big challenge the language barrier is a big challenge for me i'm i'm really doing great i'm really doing great it's just that you know when you're learning a new language there's something to do with shyness fear you there's that it's just normal i think but i'm really fighting it hard to get it out of me and just to speak you know right now i can make some good sentences i i can make some like good sentences i can speak i envision a bit well but not with confidence and that's my problem i am really struggling to bring this con confidence on top because it will help me because the thing is I meet people and uh, when I say something small in German probably I feel like ah shit I did not pronounce it well oh my god uh, how are they thinking about me I'm not even perfect you know I can't even like speak well or sometimes you get into a conversation and then you can speak some of it some of the language and then in between 
you can no longer continue speaking the language because you ki you cannot form the sentences or probably the other person who is talking to is a native speaker and it gets challenging when they are speaking the native in them and getting to hear them it becomes quite a challenge yeah so that 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 has been the challenge but so far so good and of course i'm missing my family so much i'm missing home the environment you, you know i was raised there for so many years i stayed there i adapted with the culture there with everything so it's like i had to start afresh i'm not complaining i'm just saying so when you're coming to a country when you're coming to a country afresh you know what you're going to get you know we're so quick to want to carry our suitcases and come to a new destination not knowing what awaits us and this is for people who are coming for a longer stay like i have not for shorter term for shorter term is not a hassle it's not that of a hassle you have few days maybe few weeks probably you want to come and explore and test this side of the world and just basically feel how different it is from home so you don't even need to like uh, you don't really your priority is not really like a homely feeling it's much more of an exploration to the new place yeah so we are almost not so far away you can hear i don't know if you can hear the sounds from the sea you know the sea creatures it's so beautiful it's so peaceful here so peaceful you know and like that makes you calm rejuvenated it makes you just happy everything everything is just perfect yeah so i can imagine how people are feeling here the people who are living around the sea because there are so many houses around the sea i can't even imagine how they're feeling it's a great feeling like i'll be seated as i'll be seated outside every time if i was living in this such a place I'll be going to the beach, I'll be seated there just to look at the sea, you know, just to get a glimpse, get a view, and just clearing my mind off, getting some peace, peace of mind, sorry. The camera is shaking because definitely we are driving and oops, I didn't even put my seatbelt on, what a dummy thing to do. Yeah, so... Yeah, so that was it. Our journey was great. We had a very great trip. Of course, we were so tired yesterday, very tired. But all in all, we managed to uh, do a few things. Like we came over to walk around the sea, you know, like an evening. Spazieren uh, gehen, that is German, to like take a stroll. Yeah, and it was so so amazing let's see where we are going it's so amazing really 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 amazing as you can see everyone is all dressed up ready to hit the sea oh, oh you saw that space where you can enter oh it's so beautiful uh -huh. oh my goodness you know these things you're so good at finding these nice corners. I just huh? wanted to like uh, see. You have I an idea where we're going to park the car? Uh, I told you that there is a wall. Ah, the wall. Uh, where you can, it's it's literally in the front of the city. Oh really? Yeah. Wow. It just I like, like it. I hope no one is there. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a small no. road. Are you trying to find the way? It's not so thin. You think so? I don't know. I mean, but that is just like almost at the sea. Yes, yes. I don't know. I just go a bit further. Okay. All right. Sure. Mm -hmm. Is that this the one or some other? Yeah. Okay, my loves, let's catch up uh, at the, the beach. Uh, we I have to find our way to the sea. We are using some shortcuts and hopefully we manage to get the way 100% correctly. Let's catch up at the sea. Ciao, ciao.
Ah, just a glimpse of the sea, guys. Like, as we drive, we're still driving. And over there, I don't know if you can see well. Over there is the sea. Oh my goodness. Like, I'll be in this environment, like, for a whole year. Because that is so beautiful. It's perfect. Nature is perfect. Uh, so perfect. You see, I'm, I mean, we're quite a distance from it still at the moment, but we'll see. Let's see if you can see it as we get closer. So guys, like I said, I am back with a bang. I mean, I hope not to go away again. A lot happened and like I said, life happens. Everyone has a season. Some of you has a good season while some of you have a bad season. So, And vice versa. So everyone has their season each and every time. There's a season for everything as well yeah oh it's a rough road it's hard to drive order i need to go slowly because like it's the is it car slippery is low. do you think ah the car is no, low car yeah is it low. will get some injury but it's a thin road do you think oh okay, okay. do you think it's gonna fit well here uh, there is a fence or a something. That's what you're talking about. A wall. There is a fence. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Hmm, it's definitely dry. But is it like uh, allowed? Huh? Is this air allowed? Oh, no, I didn't packing? see that it's forbidden. Uh -huh. Almost at the sea. Hey, oh, see how beautiful it is. Hey. Whew, I'm so excited right now. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they're not are they strict like German. In German, right now, you'll be having some nice tickets, some pretty tickets. What? To pay. No, for what? Because of their button, like. But German, no, they no, like no, they no, put no. signs, right? Yes. It's very important. No, 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 no. Mm. So. Ah, let's say it's our hidden treasure, our hidden place. Hard to get those things which are hard to get the most sweet. Mm, yeah, yeah. <laughs> really. <laughs> Uh, uh, if 